Broodmead Less Attached, also known as Leslie. Leslie is a 12-year-old broodmare that was injured on June 30, 2009. She was admitted to an equine hospital in Kentucky with a puncture wound in her left front foot. This puncture wound was caused by a nail that had penetrated her navicular bursa and shredded the attachment of the deep flexor tendon. Leslie was hospitalized for six weeks where she had surgery, multiple medical procedures, and was treated with antibiotics. She remained in critical condition and was referred by her attending veterinarian to Kesmark, one of only two state-of-the-art hyperbaric oxygen centers in Kentucky. She arrived at that facility on August 12, 2009. After nine hyperbaric treatments over 10 days, there is already marked improvement in her foot and her lameness was upgraded from a 5 of 5 to a 4 of 5. This is Leslie after 18 hyperbaric oxygen treatments. Her condition has now been upgraded to a 3 of 5 degree lameness. She is very comfortable and off all medications. Leslie has now had 21 hyperbaric oxygen treatments and her condition has been upgraded to a 2 of 5 lameness. She has a very slight gait deficit while trotting but is continuing to improve every day. As you can see, not only has Leslie's injury healed dramatically, but her overall health is much improved. Leslie is no longer on any treatments. She has now been at Kesmark for 44 days and her quality of life has returned to normal. She is now ready to resume her career as a champion producing broodmare and will be going home soon. Max came to Kesmark February 9, 2008. He suffered from a severe fracture in his right shoulder and had complete radial nerve paralysis. As you can see, he was barely able to walk. Typically, a horse with this type of injury would be euthanized. Max was treated in the hyperbaric oxygen chamber 10 times the first month he was at Kesmark. This was to help regenerate his radial nerve. He was also fitted with a special brace to assist in his walking. As part of the Kesmark rehabilitation process, Max was also introduced to swimming to help strengthen all of his muscles. By the middle part of April, Max was very comfortable walking and barely had any gait deficit. On April 25th, 2008, Max was released to go back home to Tennessee to be with his proud owner. Max can now run and play and he is very happy and no longer in pain. We expect Max to enjoy many more days of sunshine.
Simon arrived at Kesmark with an infection in his left hind ankle. His lameness was considered a four out of five, and he was almost non-weight bearing. Simon had been on and off antibiotics since December 4, 2007. This is Simon after two weeks of treatment. He was treated in the hyperbaric oxygen chamber two times a day for four days, then once a day for 10 days. His lameness was markedly improved within the first week, and he is continuing to improve. He is no longer on any pain medication. Simon is going home soon, and we look forward to him having a successful career.